What was Coach Kelly's you know, message to you, or how did did he say, hey, he wants things done this way, or was it, hey, just you know, keep doing what you've been doing? Just like I said, the, the competition, the mental, mental physical toughness, uh, science, you know, based to the, to the program, all these things uh, we were able to implement uh, under that vision. But he, you know, he's been great with, with allowing me to run, you know, the, the type of stuff that, that works within those, you know, those brands. Is there anything unique that you that you feel that your program does, maybe compared to pretty much the vast majority of college football? I, you know, I just think that yeah, it's all about how hard uh, the guys train. I don't know that that's unique. I think it's a, it's a mentality. Uh, every time you come in there, you either get better or you get worse. You, know, you just put together successive days of getting better and getting better and getting better. And getting better that, uh, Eventually, you know, you'll be a champion. Is there a motto or a phrase that you're trying to instill in the guys every day? No, I think it's just, it's just the consistency of embracing the process that, that Coach Kelly uh, has put out there. So how, what's the approach like, you know, implementing mental toughness uh, on the field and off the field? I mean, is, it, is it different? I mean, how do you kind of approach that? those things separately. You have to be able to maintain your focus and composure, uh, your body language, the ability to continue to attack the reps with the same effort. You, know, whether you start to get tired, everybody fatigues at some point. You know, you try to, to lower that fatigue, uh, to increase your ability to handle your fatigue so that mentally you can you can focus longer and increase that mental toughness. Is there any change from the summer to when you get into the season as far as how you approach workouts? Maybe you change the regimens a little bit? You know, the, the, the mindset doesn't change, the mentality and the weight room does not change. We'll control load and how much they're doing based on practice and, and game reps. Uh, but you can't get too far away from, from what you believe. This might be kind of hard to answer, but you know, when you look, when you get to the end of 2017 and you're looking back, how do you? How do you determine success for your program, and how do you? What factors do you really look at? You know, it, it's obviously you have to win. Uh, that's always a huge deal. <laughs> but also, you know, from from players, you know, success and how they did, and you know, they you know individually for players, and then you look at the units, you look at position and how they did, and how how they function, their movement, you know, their their ability to sustain effort at a high level throughout the season. You know, health, player health is definitely a part of it. I mean, it's all part of it. Thank you. Yes, sir.